I was in school at the University of Illinois. I had received a PhD in physics, in theoretical physics. GE had a very good reputation in science and technology. We had a lot of firsts. GE had two Nobel Prize winners at that point, Irving Langmuir and Ivor Gaver. And as I said, I joined the group that Ivor Gaver was in. All of the MRI business, all of MRI has come about while I have been here. It started in the 1980s. I saw it from the very beginnings where people in the group that I was managing at the time helped develop the very first MRI machine. I think that may be one of the most exciting things that I have been involved with. I've now compressed 38 years into the present where I started doing my current job, which is as chief scientist for elect electrical technologies and systems. GE Global Research is sort of like a university in its breadth which is very interesting to me if you're inclined toward a lot of different things and a lot of breadth as I am personally, then having the opportunity to work in a place that has a little bit of everything going on because the businesses of GE are so broad is very stimulating. I prefer hobbies which have a lot of exercise in them, sort of a good counterpose to uh, my life at work. And so I've done a lot of hiking, um, I'm an Adirondack 46er and a Catskill 35er. I like distance biking and I often put about mm, 3,000 miles on my bike during, uh, during a year. Another uh, hobby I have is actually ballroom dancing. I'm a licensed scuba diver. Sure. I've skydived as well. I very much enjoy cultures, different cultures. And in fact, that's one of the things I very much like about GE Global Research. If you just look around, we have people from just about every country on the planet here. My favorite movie recently, just thinking quickly, is probably The Matrix. My favorite book uh, may be The Religions of Man by Smith, who's a professor at MIT. Probably my favorite place to visit, not too far away, would be the Adirondack Mountains in upstate New York. My favorite food is sushi. My favorite person not related to technology would probably be President Obama. My biggest piece of advice would be never stop learning. Always learn. Always take advantages to learn more. And whatever your interests are, whatever your hobbies are, whatever your work is, always improve yourself, learn more.